Okay, Eddie Motola here back with another video. Today I'm going to be reviewing the U.S. Army <clears throat> Air Patrol. It's actually certified from the U.S. Army, it actually says over here. And, yeah. So here's the packaging. Nothing much. Yeah. So see, it shows one helicopter, one guy, and a bunch of guns. So we're going to open this up and put them out. All right, so that's everything out. So we're gonna start. We're gonna first start with the main part of the playset. All right, it's gonna be the helicopter. Now, if I'm correct, it's the MH uh, MH6 Little Bird. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. But yeah. Empty inside. Just put your gun in here, and that's a little mini gun. In the bottom, U.S. Army Patrol, and then you got the wings. And yeah, basically a helicopter. What you expect from a helicopter? And yeah. Now we're gonna uh, we're gonna check out the pilot. Now his face is melting with the helmet. You don't see? Weird face. I mean. For the U.S. Army, G.I. Joe, whatever the hell you want to call it, they don't really make the best quality figures. I mean, in the back, there's no camo or really any equipment in the back. Looks like it's just, like, paint uh, splooge all over the place for this guy. I mean, I don't even think he can hold any weapons. And that's the sad part with some of these figures. But yeah, that'll be it for him. Now, look for the accessories. So we got a Spaz. Spaz shotgun. Spaz 12, I think. Yep. And... Close up on that. 1911. With a, with a flashlight. And then you got the M60 machine gun. Where you can put this bullet loop in here. And for stun motions, go through and yeah, make your guy shoot it. And then you got the little grenades. And then a the little knife. And always the shovel. The binoculars. And lastly, the radio. You put in your guy's back. Like, if it even fits. There we go. Try and make this guy hold a gun. See if you can do that. Pistol. Damn, you cannot barely, you can barely hold a gun. I guess he's holding M19, weirdly. Yeah. I mean, as a figure, he can be good as an extra or just a helicopter pilot. I don't think he's really equipped to be beyond the battlefield, especially if you cannot hold a gun right. I mean, most he can be, like I said, as a pilot or a door gunner. But yeah, for the accessories, I do like the machine gun. And, I mean, the rest is just, you know, stuff you expect from a true hero, G.I. Joe type of thing. And the uh, helicopter would be really cool. Not sure if I can... Yeah, I don't think so. That's yeah, a little hook up down there and yeah final rating gave it an 8 out of 10 it's not that great but it's not that bad either and it's definitely a decent little set to have in the background of a stop motion so yep 
uh, 8 out of 10. And that's basically the review. Now like, comment, subscribe, and you know the rest. And now, Eddie Matula signing out. Peace.